the Victoria end. Tim Traver back behind the goal. He'll feed on left wing. Here's a Greek in the center. Late pass knocked away by Chicky. And turned back here by Spencer Main on right wing. Sends towards the goal. And Hamilton a good job to knock it aside to the near side wall. Traver hit off it here. Oh, we get a penalty. This one is going to be going to Vasco. And then Rintel comes in to fight with Vasco. Vasco in his first WHL fight, the European for Kelowna. Trying to go at it here with Rintoul. Rintoul some rights. Rintoul would be more proactive in terms of scrapping, but give Vasco some credit here for actually dropping the gloves. Lost his helmet on the play and tried to exchange with Rintoul. I didn't think, I don't think Vasco knew he was in a fight yet. You can see he was just swinging. You got to grab on with one of those hands and throw with the other. Traber's cut. I think he got hit into the boards. There might be a visor cut. Traber's at the bench being looked at by the training staff of the Victoria Royals. Absolutely belted the other night late on the ice for a couple of minutes, and Traber won't miss a shift. Yeah, he's cut. I don't know if that's five. He hit him in the shoulder. It wasn't a head shot. But definitely Traber gets cut on that play in his... I don't know if he's dazed and then the fight. So Rinchel gets the extra two for that. I guess just when you take a look at the WHL now, is they want to get any of that type of hitting out of the game. I mean, whether it be a checking from behind situation, I know what you're saying. I mean, you, you take a look at it on video replay. All right, does it deserve a penal, penalty? Absolutely. But yeah, is it a five-minute major game misconduct? I don't think it, it deserves that, but uh, that's what the call will be. And uh, now we'll see.